hailing the country's response to COVID-19, fighting global warming and boosting the Russian economy. In his annual speech to the nation, Vladimir Putin shared his views on a wide range of issues, while he avoided making any references to his rival Alexei Navalny. Then, when the time came to address the other elephant in the room, the Russian leader remained evasive. I hope that no one dares to cross the red line with Russia, and we will determine where that line is in each specific case. Those who organize any provocations threatening the core security interests of Russia will feel sorry for their deeds like never before. A warning that comes as tensions between Russia and the West have reached an all-time high. Russia's military buildup near Ukraine has sent alarm bells ringing across Europe, while the Kremlin continues to reject their concerns. Russia has ramped up military exercises in the Black Sea, deploying 20 warships on Tuesday. Fighter jets and land forces have also taken part in the drills. This as Russia has blocked navigation in parts of the Black Sea for military and other official vessels until the end of October, a move that could disrupt Ukraine's strategic access to the Sea of Azov. In recent weeks, satellite images have shown Russia's steady military buildup. According to the European Foreign Affairs chief Josep Borrell, over 100,000 Russian forces have massed on Ukraine's border and Crimea. Russia, meanwhile, insists that it is free to deploy its army on its territory.